He got a nice little haircut. He look real good. Yeah, get up. That alarm should have went off by now. Boo, why you all up in here, baby? Giving grown woman, classy, sophisticated. You girl, I. Outside in the AMG. Right outside. TT. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. Still with the I just got done putting up the wallpaper above that wall I didn't do it too I didn't do it as pre I didn't do it as precise as this wall because I mean that's just you know that's barely gonna be seen so if you see it's a little man still don't worry about it <laughs> I just need it to overall look like it's one wall and look the same so I need to free up some space because I need to finish putting the pompous on that pompous arrangement but i don't want all that pompous grass to fall down on this couch so i need to move the couch but in order to move the couch i still got my old table in here so i'm about to break down this um what is this this rod it's a clothing rack that i got from walmart um that's what i used to put my hair on but now we've upgraded to this beautiful display on the wall so I'm gonna go ahead and take these hooks off of here. Hooks up here. And lift this side. Ugh. Jesus. I forgot to put these out in the sun. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna blow dry them a little bit and then I'm gonna spray them with some hairspray. And that's just gonna have to that's just gonna have to be that. I'm gonna do it in the bathroom because the bathroom is a lot easier to clean up than carpet because there's no carpet in here, so don't gotta worry about it. I'm gonna start with these ones because I have to pull some from the sides and then I'm gonna start filling in the middle. And I don't wanna take the sun off because I got three nails in there. So I'm just gonna try to work around the sun. All right, I think this looks much better. You can barely see the green on the inside. Absolutely love. Let's turn her on. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is gonna be the start of another Living Alone weekly vlog. It's only gonna be maybe half the week in this one. It's already Tuesday and a lot has been happening just like the last vlog um, between Sunday, Monday, and today. <laughs> I've still been selling stuff in my apartment and getting new stuff, running here and there. Prince had a groomer's appointment today. It was supposed to be at 3 p.m., but he went at 12 because he the guy who did them was uh he had two cancellations so yeah but if you're new here hey girl my name is Akira Janae don't forget to subscribe and join the video before you leave so it's 4 32 she said 
Okay, on my way leaving Pulaski Tech. Okay, so I'm about to sell my old coffee table. Um, selling it to who I gave my couch to. It's her sister and her twins. They always buy a lot of my stuff. So really, really thankful for them. If y'all watching this, thank y'all so much. Um, they always come through. Every time I'm selling something, they always usually get it first. So yeah, I'm about to go ahead and take it off of Facebook Marketplace. Um, like I said, Prince got groomed. Um, I just did a Shein haul, so I did the try-on portion. And then when I get back from giving her this table, I'm going to um, sit down and do, like, me talking about it. Um, they only want, like, a Instagram reel or a TikTok video. But usually with Shein clothes, I kind of go ahead and do, like, double the content. And I, like, do a sit-down video. So that's just more content for me. I do have two videos ready to be posted, but they got to be approved first. So I do have videos. I haven't really been consistent with posting, but I have been consistent with the recording. So I've been recording a lot for y'all. I just can't post them until the freaking company accept it. So that's annoying. But yeah, um, I had chicken filet today. I'm starving. I'm probably going to do an online pickup for in the morning for tomorrow because I really do need to get some groceries. It's just something for the rest of this week and then I can really sit down and figure out what I want. You gonna show him your haircut? They cut his ears. Um, I told him to cut his ears, but it was a different guy that did his uh, haircut today. I didn't realize it. There's a Bobby and a Billy that works at PetSmart. So when I booked it, I couldn't remember if it was Bobby or Billy because he hasn't been in like two months. So he got a nice little haircut. He looked real good. Um, I told them to cut down his ears, but like he cut them really short. I said I just wanted like a little trim, and I don't like the way he did that. That's ugly. I just wanted them how they were. I just wanted them shorter. Like I want his same ears, just cut shorter. But it's fine. His hair usually grows back pretty fast. So we'll deal with it, huh? You just you you gonna burp on me? <laughs> So yeah, we'll deal with it, but he looks really good. Um, I did a full bath and haircut today for him. Um, I added on the teeth brushing and the uh, breath stuff or whatever. So I do need to stop at Walmart tomorrow, put it in my cart um, to put in the water to make their breath smell good. But I do need to do a better job at brushing his teeth daily because yeah, just like a human, we brush our teeth daily. Their dogs need their teeth brushed daily. So I'm gonna try to get back into the habit of doing that. <laughs> He's just looking like, girl, who you talking to? But yeah. Wanted to show him a little bit more and show y'all because somebody had commented. I blocked her from my page. I didn't block her, but when somebody comments some stupid stuff or some crazy stuff, I go ahead and hide user from channel so you won't ever be able to comment on any one of my videos ever again as long as my channel exists. So somebody was like, what are they? I don't even know what they said. Something like, oh, you don't show him attention and you're so mean to the dog. Blah, 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 blah. Baby, every time I start recording, he starts squeaking at toys. So I be having to go somewhere else out the room to talk to y'all. Those who not me, y'all know I don't play by my son. He is going to be six years old this year and we don't play about Prince. Okay, so don't let me tell, tell him, don't make me tell my cyber aunties and uncles. Yeah. Cause they will attack y'all <laughs> so yeah i hit them for my channel because baby i don't got time for the bs y'all know i love my son Th this is my child like i birthed him okay don't play but yeah all right sit over there poops um but yeah that's pretty much all i'm gonna do right now um i had my day completely planned out girl but since I took him earlier, I was supposed to do the haul while he was getting groomed. The guy got done quick as hell. So I literally only had enough time to do my freaking makeup. So I'm about to go ahead and head to Park Plaza is where I like to meet uh, most people for um, things to pick up. I got majority of the table in my car already. I just got to add the other piece of glass in there. Um, and I wanted to clean out my car today and just do everything. So I got one more off day tomorrow before I have to go back to work. Um, I'm going to try to wake up a lot earlier tomorrow and I'm going to like map out my day like hour by hour. I don't really want to do too much, but I do need to get some stuff done. So I guess I'll save editing for when I'm at work, but work been kind of crazy to where I can't really edit too much. Like I be in the patient's rooms and like tending to the patient. So we don't really have much downtime anymore. But um, yeah, I do need to clean up my car. So I'm not gonna do that today. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I'm tired as hell. I'm hungry. 
so after i drop this off i'm not gonna lie i am probably gonna give me something to eat like grab it on the way i kind of want mozzarella sticks again i've been craving mozzarella sticks like real bit i haven't had sonic in probably six seven months and i recently just started eating sonic again and baby it's been busting so i think i want to get some mozzarella sticks my favorite drink from sonic is a cherry lime mm, mm, mm. can already taste it so yeah on my way back home i'll probably get that but i just want to update y'all real quick um, I know I did already start recording some stuff, so I'll probably plug that in right now. I was recording the other day. Um, let me, this is how this room is looking, girl. We, we've been doing a lot, so let me turn that off, close that. She's leaving now. I'm going to go ahead and I'll be back. I'm going to lock you in here, okay? Let me turn off this ring light. All right, I'll be back, poops. I'm doing not too crazy in there. So um, I need my glasses because I can't see. I do have on lashes, so since I got on lashes, I'm not gonna take them off right now because I still gotta come back and record. I'm gonna put on my black glasses because they're a little bit bigger than my um, clear ones. And I also picked up some snacks for Prince, literally trying to get cash back because I did tap to pay for my first transaction and it don't allow you to get cash back when you tap. So I tried to buy these separately and you got to spend over $5 to get cash back. I'm like, I wish somebody would have told me that. So I couldn't even get him a tip and I hate that. Like I hate not giving a tip for, you know, like the grooming and stuff. I don't, I just don't like that. So next time I go, I am going to try to book the guy who normally do, does Prince. So I think, I don't know, I'm gonna have to look. I can't remember if it was Billy or Bobby who do it. <laughs> but I'm just gonna give both of the men a tip, the one who actually does it, and then the one who did it last time because I like to tip them for that really good. I usually do like $10, but this is a little like hot dog. This is so cute for dogs. And then I used to give Princess all the time a little natural like dog biscuit. So yeah, he gonna get that when I get back, but I do need to hurry up and uh, be on my way. So I'm about to go ahead and hydrate myself if I'm thirsty. Ooh. All right, where my wallet at? Okay, I got my wallet, phone, keys, AirPods. It takes me like 10 minutes to get up there, but I do got to take down another piece of glass, so I'm gonna have to turn the camera off. But my table comes in one like frame, and then it got two glass pieces, so. I didn't take this one down yesterday. I'm gonna take it down today. And then I gotta show y'all what I got from Sally's. Don't let me forget to show y'all that because I'm probably gonna be bleaching my hair tomorrow. Now, I was supposed to be doing that today. That's why I'm trying to get all my content out the way like with my hair done right now until I get back because I miss being blonde, but we'll talk about that when I get back home. So I'm gonna go ahead and meet her, take this downstairs, and then I'll probably talk to y'all when uh we get to sonic and then back home i wasn't even recording i was just talking to y'all just ordered my food and just paid yeah get up that alarm should have went off by now oh. yeah oh. Mm. 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 <laughs> get up Mm -hmm. You a long one off? Mm -mm. Mm, I don't think you did. I won't even record. I'm a horrible vlogger today. I won't even record. Mm. <laughs> Give me no straw either. I should press that red button. <laughs> but I ain't even gonna do them like that. Got a straw right here. I do like to keep straws and stuff on my thing. All right, let's get back to the house. So I'm starving. Should have told them light ice too. I gotta start saying light ice on stuff. Mmm. Make sure lime bag gonna hit every time. Y'all ride with y'all bag open or closed so y'all uh, food stay hot. I ride with mine closed. Comment down below. Roll up out of chum. Boo, why you all up in here, baby? <laughs> well, always in my business when I'm recording, baby. Boo, what you looking at? <laughs> I don't understand. 
Like y'all ain't never seen no camera before. I'm just gonna get it. You look all you want, baby, because it's making me some money. Okay. Tell me when you wake up. I'm up. So fresh, I'm about to go and beat you, buddy boy. Real bad. All right, I'll talk to y'all when I get to the house. Peace. All right, it is 8 o'clock on the dot, Tuesday, April 23rd. And we're going to do a little haul before I start editing this clothing haul and stuff. So I think I told y'all before I left that I went to Sally's Beauty Supply. Uh, I think I went there Sunday. No, I went there Monday since today. No, I went there Sunday because I returned the stuff Monday. So, I went to Sally's and got this big old bag of stuff. My total from Sally's was like $109. So, y'all know, well, some of you may know, but I've been blind for, let me change my battery because it's going to pee me off. Okay, so like I was saying, I've been blonde, like I've had blonde hair since high school. Um, I used to have red hair in high school and then I dyed it back black and then I started getting blonde highlights in my hair and then I literally just went all blonde. So I've had different variations of blonde. If I feel like doing all the editing, going back, finding all these pictures, then I'll post them right now. <laughs> if not, sorry. But <laughs> I bleached my hair with y'all before, I think in like 2021 and then I did get it in like 2022. Or 23 last year one of those but last year i went black um i think i went black in june to be able to promote my brand a lot more um i really wanted to get into the traditional sew-ins which i could definitely do a traditional sew-in with blonde hair but it's just i wanted y'all to be able to and i wanted to have a lot of content and stuff of me just in the hair in its natural state because obviously i got blonde hair so when i get the hair i will be promoting it with you know colored hair like blonde hair i wouldn't be able to promote it with black hair i could if i get like a closure and stuff but y'all know i'm not even really a closure and frontal girl i'm definitely not a frontal girl but i would definitely wear a closure before a frontal so i just i just like to have my hair out like this especially traditional sew ins last a lot longer than closures and frontals anyway and i don't i don't really like all the glue like i don't like that so I am ready to go back blonde. <laughs> I've been black for almost a year now. When I first dyed it, it definitely was giving grown woman, classy, sophisticated. You know, it's still real cute. But I just feel like I'm a blonde girl at heart. Like, <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I would definitely throw on, you know, a little quick black wig, sewing and stuff from now on. But I just miss my real hair being blonde. Not as bright as my last blonde. Like, my hair was already blonde. So I told my hairstylist that I basically wanted to be like all one color because it was kind of like, it was kind of like two different colors. So basically she couldn't like darken it she just had to go lighter basically so i had a very very bright blonde and I, i'm not trying to go for that bright anymore i'll probably pop a video or something right here so anyways we're gonna do a little haul. i plan to bleach my hair tomorrow i'm off all day tomorrow i do got an online pickup between 8 and 9 a.m so all i gotta do is just pull up i can put on a hat or something like that uh, with my hair looking crazy but i do plan to bleach my hair tomorrow i do want to start early in the morning so that way i could be done by like one two o'clock um my real hair takes a lot especially with bleaching the process is a lot and as well as i'm probably going to bleach my bundles with this so i can get the same color because i do actually want to get this hair put back in so this is my raw vietnamese straight that i sell so sally's note to self don't ever go to sally's beauty supply go to y'all little hood little uh beauty market and beauty supply stores and get y'all stuff because my sally's thing what i tell y'all how much was it oh i got back 67 dollars because i went back and i returned some stuff so my original price was 109 dollars and 83 cents i'm like when i walked out because i haven't you know bleached my hair in a long while and i'm like mm, i've never paid over like $50 give or take for bleaching you know my hair so I went and returned that stuff and went and got it from the beauty supply store so from the beauty supply store I bought this tub of quick blue I've never used quick blue 
bleach i've always used bw2 but i've been doing some research and basically bw2 was just like a pure white powder and this one since it's blue it kind of go ahead and slightly like tone your hair so it you won't you won't have to do too much toning if you use this one so i am going to do a patch test since it's my first time i'm going to be using this one so i'm gonna patch test and see how it is but anyways this was 15.99 at the beauty supply why at sally's they're charging 24.99 girl bye. and then from the beauty supply i also picked up my toners um luckily they had the colors that i needed so i've already already had this one so that was free and then i got these two um t11 for 5.99 and sally's beauty they're 9.99 so half the price love that for me i'm about to take out my sewing so i'm about to um put on a vlog over here and then i'm gonna take out my sewing over here my vanity so it doesn't uh get messy in here over here by my desk because usually i'll sit at my desk but i'm gonna sit in my vanity vanity take out my sewing and i'm probably gonna put on chelsea janae um and then i'll watch raven elise just because chelsea's hers are like longer vlogs and with raven elise some of her stuff here recently is stuff that like i really need to pay attention to um like Zaya's birthday party all of that type of stuff and her building and all of that so I'd be want to like actually watch and whereas like just a regular vlogger kind of like me or like Chelsea Janae <laughs> she um you know you can just listen to what we say because usually we just talking most of the time and then you know then we'll like go do stuff so yeah I'm about to turn her on um one of y'all bought a closure she literally you just commented on my other video so I'm about to buy your closure right now she said yes total 76 dollars so i'm about to go ahead and pay for this and it should be here by this weekend i told her i'll ship it out by saturday and then she should get it by the beginning of the week i do plan to restock fully um in june and it's looking like i'm going to need more virgin hair than raw hair because the girlies y'all are eating the virgin hair up like this is my new well this is my raw enemy straight absolutely love i'm going to restock both but i'm probably going to have more bundles of my virgin hair whereas having more of this but i'm going to do a poll on instagram so make sure you follow my business page on instagram at ajb beauty collection all together so yeah, I'm about to turn on all of this again. I'm about to get my scissors. I'm about to take this sewing out. And then will y'all see me in about, hopefully it's only going to take an hour. Because it feel like it'll be real easy to take these uh, wefts off. Because yeah, I can already just feel through the thread and stuff. So it should only take an hour. I'm about to go ahead and buy this. I'm going to start keeping my hair ties up in here. I got all these dang, everything gills for the hair tie. Look at that dirt. So you know your hair ruin. That's why they mean your hair ruin. All right, it's 8:48 and I'm done taking out all of my um, bundles. So here we are. I'm gonna wash and condition and stuff like that, and I do plan on bleaching these and put them back in. But it's only 8:48 and I started about 8:18, I'ma say. So 28, 38, 48. So it took about 30 minutes to take all of this out. Um, not too bad. So I'm going to go ahead and take out my braids as well. What I want to do in the morning is to already have my hair like uh, shampooed and conditioned and stuff like that. Maybe. Because I have bleached my hair before on dirty hair. So I don't know. We'll see. Because my I just I did wash my soul in and tried to get into my hair but um we'll see all right so i took all my uh braids out oh baby girl we're gonna keep that on <laughs> so i took all my braids out um freed up just six minutes of space but it is 9 33 now i kind of been stopping watching tv um i kind of want to make me something to eat real quick i've been snacking on chicks mix but yeah my hair is down i do need to shampoo condition and wash it so that tomorrow when i wake up and blow dry it tonight so that tomorrow when i wake up i can wake up to clean hair and i think i just gonna go ahead and do the patch test tomorrow after i get my groceries and everything and then i'm just gonna put it in a ponytail um 
after I shampoo condition and stuff. But one thing I wanted to mention real quick is that I've been blonde, like I said, dang near <laughs> all my life. So I feel like my hair was more healthy when it was blonde, which obviously when you like bleach your hair and stuff, like you're chemically damaging your hair. But for me, since I've been blonde so long and I feel like my hair was like basically um, like color trained or like bleach trained or whatever. And now that I've been wearing those traditional sewings and stuff and I had that side part, that side part burned my hair out so bad because I had to keep flat ironing and like fixing my edges and stuff. So I will say when I was blonde, my hair was so much longer than this. Like my air fro would be like out here and I just kind of pulled down my hair and my hair got, my hair has gotten so much shorter with it being black. So it's like, I'm trying to re, like I'm trying to change everything about how my hair was. And I just don't like it. Like I like my hair blonde. My hair was always really like for it to be chemically processed and stuff. It was a very healthy chemically processed <laughs> of hair, if that makes sense. So yeah, and I always feel like after I do bleach my hair, I feel like my curls pop a lot better than they would when my hair like you know isn't bleached i don't know maybe because i've been blonde for so long that's just you know i know how to manage my hair train my hair all of that and now my hair is slightly uneven like it's shorter in the front obviously and longer in the back and this side had broke off quite a bit but it's um it didn't grow back a lot because it used to be about like this short since i had that and I've been trying to do sewings and stuff, so it's kind of growing back, but I'm just ready to be back blonde and get my hair back to how it used to be. Like I said, I probably put in different videos and pictures and stuff, but yeah, that's what I miss. So I'm gonna go ahead and maybe fix me something to eat real quick. I'm still watching all of Destiny. I'm watching that girl chat. It's all of uh, it's her and her two sisters, Desaad and Dominique. So yeah, I'll probably talk to y'all tomorrow after I figure out uh SD card that I got some more space on, but yeah. Hey y'all, good morning. It is April, I know it's, it's Wednesday, April 24th. I went to bed at like 2 a.m. It's 8.58 in the morning. And I think I told y'all yesterday that I was gonna do a Walmart pickup. So I'm on my way to Walmart, I just woke up. So my voice sound like this, cause I'm still trying to wake up. Literally just jumped out of bed and got up. Um, Walmart. I told them that I was on my way and my pickup was from 8 to 9 a.m. It is currently 8.59. Um, left my glasses at home. I can I can still see without my glasses. It's just I can't like I'm nearsighted so I can see things that's close to me. So I can definitely like see while driving and stuff. It's just if I was to need to like see a sign or something then I really can't see that or like a street sign or something like that street name i can't see till i like get up on it like right now but obviously i know where i'm going i'm on right up the street so yeah but i'm tired as hell i wanted to get up early today that was the whole point of booking it this early i should have just did nine to ten so that i could just get up and not be rushing but i'm here now and it's nine o'clock so i'm gonna go ahead and put off part so they don't I've never not picked up a Walmart order on time so yeah I don't know what happens if you don't pick it up at your specific time but I did I'm on my way and then I did I've parked so when I get there I'm gonna punch a number in and it's a little cold this morning so I got my heat on 80 up in this car 68 degrees it ain't no sun out or nothing Lord Jesus, I'm tired as hell. Whew. And I still gotta do my hair today, so I plan to put these groceries and stuff up. I'm probably gonna go back downstairs, take prints out. Um, my stomach is hurting a little bit, but I think that's because I woke up and cooked uh, like sausage and biscuit at what, dang near midnight? <laughs> and then I had ate some Chex Mix, like just mixing stuff, damn. went off girl I thought it was <laughs> I had to go in and get my groceries I'm like no I am not dressed to go inside Ugh, let me pull this back because I think that's why it'd be dark too <gasps> my trunk I got this scooter and stuff back there Oh, 
time. Take your time, do this uh, feedback for the promoter. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> All right, so I took the camera down since he was putting it in my car because that's awkward. <laughs> um, yeah, everything fit. I only got 20 items, so I'm gonna put my bread up here. Yeah, that's my little groceries back down. All right, so if I go ahead and head back home, I'm um, about to check my man location because he said he was coming to, he was coming up here today. He at home right now. I don't know if he's gonna go to sleep first and then come up here. I would rather him do that because um, I'm trying to get my hair bleached and I would like to do that before he get here to kind of like surprise him. So I'm about to FaceTime him and be like, you can come when you wake up, like that's fine. <laughs> Cause he he loves my blind hair and he, he be trying to make jokes and be funny talk about some, oh, I forgot. Uh, I forgot how you look when you was blind or um uh, I forgot uh I don't know he be saying something and then just be telling me like you know he missed the blind and all of that or just just other stuff and I'm like I ain't even been black for a whole year so what are y'all talking about and like my cousin she was like I don't remember you blind I'm like oh my gosh I've been blind literally my freaking entire life definitely adult life from now on what time are they open Today is April Thursday, April 25th, 1:24 in the evening. Me and Bae just got back home from Waffle House and going to view his new apartment. So I just checked my meal and had an Amazon box waiting on me at the door. And then I checked my real mailbox, like actual mailbox, and then the Amazon like drop hub thing, whatever. Take this jacket off. It was thunderstorming this morning, so it was so cold today. If y'all hear something that's Prince in his bowl, trying to lick the bowl for some more food. So we got the first one I'm gonna open is this little small one. I have no idea what this is. Um, I had just checked my. If you didn't know, you can sign up for like USPS um, informed delivery, so you can see all the mail that comes to your mailbox before you even like go pick it up. So I'm signed up with that, and this came from New York. I'm not sure if this is something from the fence for me to promote or what. Cause no, I don't think no one told me that I'm getting anything. Cause I got, I got that Louis bag. I got those Chanel shoes to promote. Did I ask for something else? Unless this is a watch. I think oh, this may be a watch. Let me see. How do you open this? I don't know. It's a drink. What the hell? This is a, oh, this may be my sample. Was you here or was you on the phone, babe? Remember when I was like, Alexa, send me a sample? Yeah. This may be what this is, cause she sent me something. Um, I had got uh, that little like liquid IV stuff or whatever. So this is literally a sand drift sparkling water and real squeezed fruit unsweetened lemonade and it's like ice cold so oh i'm excited to try this if you didn't know you can ask alexa to send you a sample and then she'll give you two options and then it'll like just randomly come in your mail within like a week week and a half and this is what i got this time so this is literally a sample okay it came from new york that's why i'm like what the hell did i get from new york so i'm excited to try that it say unsweetened lemonade though so i don't know about that i don't like nothing unsweet okay next one is this um, this one actually came yesterday. I ordered it yesterday and then it got here by like five o'clock. This is a SD card. I just literally had to delete footage on my SD card to, um, have footage to record right now. But I decided to go ahead and get a 256 gigabyte one. I've never had this much space. So I'm excited to see how much, um, how many minutes I get with this. I think it's about, 
I don't know. I know it's a lot of, I mean, a lot of how many hours I get with this. I know it's a lot of hours, so I'm excited to see how long I get to record. And this box right here, I know what this is. I've been waiting on this for two weeks. I almost canceled my order um, on Monday, but that's the day they had shipped it out. So I decided just to stick it out. Plus, this is the one that was rated the best on Amazon anyway. So I'm like, I didn't already wait it dang near two weeks for it. So I can wait, you know, a day or two. To my Amazon storefront, obviously. But this is the Bed Sure Essentials brand on Amazon. This is my, I think I got my duvet cover. This is my duvet insert, if I'm not mistaken. And this is the one that was rated really, really good. Yeah. So I don't know if I'm going to put this up today because I'm tired. Me doing my hair for like seven hours yesterday wore me the hell out. As well as I think I told you I was dying it. Um, it looks really good as you guys can see. But some spots are still... Just just go watch the video. My hair didn't turn blue, green. Like, it was a whole ordeal yesterday. So... I'll link the video maybe in a card right here, right here, and then down below. But y'all can go watch that video. So I'm going to try to figure out my hair. Maybe again by myself. I'm going to do a little strand test. And if the strand test doesn't go well, then I'm just going to book a hair appointment with like a color stylist here locally. The last item I got is right here. And why did I get to the door? And my package is open. Like, it's just like that. So hopefully none of my stuff is broke or missing because you better believe it's about to get right on return. Oh, I gotta go to Coast anyway and return something to Amazon. Oh, Jesus. That is wrapped separately. So I... Okay, so these are the smaller plates. How cute. So right now I have all white plates and I have clear plates. I wanted black plates because I am trying to start doing more like cook with me videos. Y'all are definitely requesting that a lot more. And y'all really enjoyed my other one. And when I was at Bay House, he had, um, y'all know, made that lamb or whatever. I think I put it as a thumbnail picture, but I forgot to include the clips of it. But if you follow me on Instagram, then you guys saw it. So he had black plates and that's how I did my like presentation on a black plate. And y'all know I love watching Gordon Ramsay, MasterChef, all of that. And the food, food to me just looks better when it's on a black plate. Like it just pops out more to me. Um, unless if you're at like a fancy restaurant and they do all that cute little like dot plating and all of that on a white plate. But I am now really loving the black plate aesthetic vibe. So I decided to give me some black plates and bowls and stuff. So this is the small one. I'm going to wash all of this or put it through the dishwasher today. I'm not going to unbox everything. I just want to make sure nothing is uh, cracked. Everything that I'm about to show y'all is listed in my Amazon storefront. Like always, always check it if you want to know where something is from. Nine times out of ten, it's from Amazon. I got my dishes over there drying. I dried most of them. So while the other ones dry, I'm going to go ahead and put my duvet cover together. Um, I got a king size. I'm going to keep this just in case if it don't work out and stuff, I'm going to return it. But this is the actual duvet um, like blanket. And then this is the duvet um, insert. So a lot of y'all were saying that I needed to get an actual insert for it. Thank you for that. I ordered it. Um, I ordered this. I think I told y'all it took like two weeks to come in. So this is what's going to be the inside of it. And it has the little bitty... Um, little loops and stuff like that so we're just going to hope for the best but this feels really soft and i think this is like a very good um thickness i guess you can say like it doesn't feel thin it doesn't feel thick my comforter that i got right now that i got from target that is actually a really really thick comforter um it's the threshold brand so i oh i'm glad they gave me two marker cases because I definitely needed them. So I got this one. My whole thing is I hope that it looks good together because y'all know I got those white sheets from Amazon and those are like pure white. So this is pure white. 
this isn't looking pure white like that it looks kind of like a off-white eggshell i don't know if y'all can pick that up on camera or not all right so i think i'm going to go ahead and end out the vlog here um thank you guys so much for tuning in this week i'm about to start another weekly vlog either tonight or starting tomorrow morning um yeah don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe sorry if this one was maybe a little short but yeah see y'all next week until my next one bye guys i'm gonna break everybody try to put me in I got a lot of enemies who used to be my friends. Pull me up before and I feel like myself again. Blow me up and don't.